Well, um, we're very fortunate we've been invited, and not only invited, but we're also a host for the Women's Basketball Invitational 16-team tournament, and very pleased to be in it. It's uh, only the fourth time in the history of Lamar Women's Basketball, the 44-year history, that we played in the postseason, and three of three of those four have come in the last four years. So we're very fortunate and very appreciative to be able to keep that uh, streak alive and host the uh, Women's Basketball Invitational, which uh, we open up with a very good team from uh, Presbyterian College out of South Carolina, out of the Big South, 19-11, and 14-4 in their league. So it should be a very good game, and I hope we get a lot of people out there to watch uh, the uh, Lady Cardinals play. Well, it's just uh, it's another way to continue to build the program, and uh, it's also another way for them to get playing time. And not only will this help us this year, you know, as we try to win as many as we can, you know, we're 21 and 10, but we're also trying to uh, get ready for next year in a very trying schedule and losing some key members so these younger ones have a chance to step up, and I think that's what they'll do. Well, it's uh, a pretty good, pretty good hit because, you know, we thought we could get to the championship game and maybe knock off uh, Oral Roberts. But, uh, you know, we had some injuries down the stretch against Stephen Elk. You know, police rolled her ankle and tried to come out and gave a valiant effort against Sam Houston, but just couldn't get any lift off of that off of that leg. And so, but mentally, I think we bounced back. I think uh, I think our players are pretty resilient, and I think we'll be ready to, to get after it and get after Presbyterian uh, Wednesday night. And that will be in the Carl Perkins Center, and that will be in... Uh, Lamar State College, Port Arthur, and we had a, a very nice practice down there today and just cannot say enough about uh, Lamar State College, Port Arthur, and uh, Scott Street, the AD, just very good people and they've made us feel welcome from the get-go.